Welcome to this video about Amazon S3 and CloudFront. Switch to S3. Create a new bucket for S3. Choose the location Tokyo. Let's upload some files. Start the upload. Get the link for the database dump file. Add question mark torrent to the URL. The file is downloaded with the BitTorrent protocol. Make the other files public. Access the link for the file. The S3 content is loaded via HTTP. S3 can replace your web server and its operation as well. Add a link to a web application running on WebLogic application server. Clicking on the link will forward you from S3 to the content behind the elastic IP of the application server. In this example the application is a simple JSP page retrieving the IP where it is running. A trace route from Munich shows the route to the content hosted in Japan. Let's enable the static content stored on S3 for CloudFront. Create a distribution.
define the start page to be loaded. The trace route from Munich is only going to Frankfurt now. The content is retrieved from the nearest cache now. There are many caches worldwide. To access the content you have to use the provided DNS name. Load the site from the cache of the content distribution network. The link forwards you to the JSP running on the EC2 instance with WebLogic. The EC2 instance is located in Singapore. Thanks for watching this screencast.